Hi guys, welcome back again to my channel, The Hissing Reptiles. Today I'm going to show you a video on snake feeding and I'm going to do the video on time lapse mode. So today I have seven fascinating snakes to show you guys. What are we waiting for? Let's have a look. Okay guys, the first snake I'm going to talk to you about is a beautiful arboreal snake. This snake name is the mangrove cat snake aka the Boiga dendrophila. This snake is also known as gold ring cat snake guys. Another one more fact about this snake is this snake is considered a rare fang snake which means the teeth is situated at the back of their mouth and they are considered mildly venomous. Mangrove cat snake are mostly nocturnal. They can be an aggressive snake when they become nervous and can strike repeatedly. Handling them of course should involve safety precautions because of the snake's nervous nature and a bite from this snake can cause pain and injury. Mangrove cat snake are often found in lowland rainforests and mangrove swamps. Like in this video, mangrove cat snake feeds on lizard, birds, small mammals and even eggs. The venom of mangrove cat snake has effect only on their prey, but in certain cases can cause intense. Okay guys, the next name we are going to talk about is a boa constrictor, also known as a red tail boa. These boa constrictor are commonly from Central, North and South America guys. And they are basically a non-venomous, large and heavy body types of snake. Boa constrictors can grow up to 3 to 13 feet in length depending on localities. Females normally become larger than male. They are viviparous, meaning they give birth to live youngs. Boa constrictors prefer living in rainforests due to the humidity and temperature. They are mostly found near rivers and streams. Boa constrictors are nocturnal species. Their bite can be very painful. Boa constrictors in shedding mode can be very defensive. They feed on mammals and birds. They constrict their prey until death before consuming it whole. Boa constrictors are ambush predators. So guys, the number 3 snake we are going to talk about is a beautiful species of python, Morelia spirota, the carpet python. Also known as a diamond python, this snake can be commonly found in Australia and New Guinea. Carpet python can grow up to 6 to 13 feet in length. This is an oviparous, laying up to 10 to 40 eggs in a time and female will coil around the eggs to protect them and keep them warm by using muscular contractions to generate heat. Carpet python are both diurnal and nocturnal meaning they are active both day and night. 
This python loves arboreal living conditions. They feed on mammals and birds by constricting them to death. Carpet python are commonly found in rainforest regions and mostly on the trees. Carpet python is a popular snake pet. However, this species has high feeding response and must be careful on handling. Number 4. It's a unique type of snake and one of the world's most beautiful type of snake. It's a colubrid snake, known as the golden tree snake aka the Chrysophilia ornata. This snake has unique capabilities of gliding flight, which means they expand their body in mid-air and glide from tree to tree in pursuit of prey and also to escape from predators. They are excellent climbers and they are very very fast. Golden tree snakes are diurnal species, which means they are only active during the day and they sleep during the night. They are also known as an arboreal species of colubrid snake, which means they live on the tree. Golden tree snakes lay oval shaped eggs, around 7 to 20 eggs every breeding season. Golden tree snake has venom, which only has effect on its prey and harmless to humans. They normally feed on birds and lizards. Number 5. The Malayan Pit Viper is a highly venomous species of vipers. They are known as pit vipers because of their heat sensing pit on the nose that detects prey. These vipers are from Southeast Asia, commonly found in overgrown farms, oil palm plantation and coastal forests. They normally feed on rats and mice. Malayan pit vipers are oviparous, which means they lay eggs and are guarded by females until they hatch. This species has a reputation for being bad tempered and quick to strike. Malayan pit vipers contain hemotoxin venom which damages the circulatory system and muscle tissue and causes swelling, hemorrhage and necrosis. Fertility rate on this snake bite are very low but they leave their victim with dysfunction or amputated limbs. Number 6. It's a majestic snake. Containing cytotoxin and neurotoxin pack of venom, this is a highly venomous species of snake, the king cobra. Known to be the longest venomous species of snake in the world, they can grow up to 19 feet in length. King cobras are from the alapid family. They are found in Southeast Asia in places like rainforests and also plantation areas. They can sense earthborne vibration of prey 330 feet away. That is a very mesmerizing stuff a king cobra can do. Containing neurotoxin and cytotoxin venom, king cobras only feed on snake and only certain times they feed on different types of food like lizards and mammals. King cobras are very defensive when guarding their eggs. They are the only species of snake which builds a nest using leaf litter for egg incubation. King cobras, when they become defensive mode, they will raise their front body, extend their hood, show their teeth and hisses loudly. King cobras can deliver multiple bites in a single attack, which makes them so dangerous that we should never get to them. 
The king cobra venom consists of cytotoxin and neurotoxin venom. The toxin affects the victim's central nervous system resulting in severe pain, drowsiness and eventually paralysis. If the effect is serious, it progresses to cardiovascular collapse and death soon follows due to respiratory failure. Number 7. The Cave Racer Also known as Beauty Red Snake, this is a species of colubrid snake. Native to Southeast Asia, they can commonly be found in deep caves and dense rainforests. Cave racers normally feed on ground-dwelling mice. Due to the X snake's extraordinary climbing abilities, they also feed on bats hanging over the cave walls. Cave racers are good pest controls and a benefit to human and other species that are affected by rodents. They are non-venomous and can grow up to 2.5 meters in length. Cave racers are mainly nocturnal. They are only active during the day after a heavy rainfall. Okay guys, that's all for our video today. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. And please don't forget to press the notification bell over there. And guys, stay tuned for our upcoming videos. Till the next video guys, see you soon.